Good morning, good morning. This is Beth. Welcome to 4x8 Paper Stuff. We are in Gentle Gross Goblins. Let's get going. Good morning, good morning. Oh man. It's blue and white today. But I'm going to pre-start my dead flowers. I think if I put Mod Podge on these leaves, they'll dry the colors they are now. And we are having leaves already falling and it's just so dry here. We need rain so bad. Everybody was complaining yesterday in their gardens. Nothing's doing well this year. But I think I could make a dead flower arrangement out of these, but I need to Mod Podge them. So I'm going to start with that and talk for a minute. And then we'll get going on blue and white. I only put blue and white in there because, number one, the picture had blue and white on it. But number two, my mom had tons of blue and white stuff. Let's see. We can put it on the back of this to Mod Podge it. I'm just going to Mod Podge the leaves. I'm not going to Mod Podge them down, theoretically. <clears throat> so yesterday I had another busy day. I went to... Where did I go? I went to a church... Oh yeah, I went to a church function and lunch. And then I went to the Knitwits, which I'm not a knitter, but they allow stragglers in with other handcrafts. And I'm a quilter, so um, you know what I should do? I should just do it on one of these, actually. And then if it does stick, I can still use it. Anyhow. Oh, got it was busy, and then today, going to the library, because our local, that's not my local library, I pay, it's the next county over, but they have a much better library makers program, which I think a lot of people are starting to get into that, and um, our county library is not that advanced, at least not at our branch, so I pay $60 a year, which I think is a pretty good investment. To be able to use that library and all its facilities, and that's where my um, audiobook program is, and everything. And you can use Blueprint through them, so that's good. Um, although I haven't done it yet. So this has been the month of art, I think. Really getting full fledged back into everything. And I had a very, very nice comment from my other viewer I think I have four of you now let's see maybe th three or four steady so hello good morning to all of you but one of them told me there's always going to be trolls don't worry about it and I know that I know that but it's like really I only have like a handful of people anyhow and I already have to have a bad one but I'm just going to kill him with kindness. And I love how Job's, on Job's journals, I watched his videos, said to be gentle to him. He's delicate to tofu. <laughs> delicate as tofu. And I'm like, oh, I love that. <laughs> I love that. I'm as delicate as tofu. Tofu. Um, I thought that was cute. So, yeah, it's just hot as blue blazes here. And we've had heat indexes of 100 and plus. No rain until maybe this weekend. I don't know. And then it may only be a tiny bit. Everybody's gardens are yucky. I went out on that paddleboard this morning. I'm, that must be why I'm perky and have energy. Um, what did I see? I saw a frog. Not a whole heck of a lot. Um, but after the paddleboard, I saw the heron and the neighbor's cat was teasing my dog, and the cat was actually stalking the heron. Um, and then the dog interrupted the stalking. And I saw a flock of blackbirds going over. They're starting to migrate out of here or into here, or I'm not sure which way they're going. Oh, I broke this leaf. That's okay, I could probably still use it. So yeah, I'm going to Mod Podge these to kind of preserve them. I think that's going to work. Painted them before. Surprisingly enough, they actually 
preserved a lot from the paint, but I kind of want them to stay their natural color. We'll see. If this doesn't work, don't tell me, okay? I'll let you all know if it works when we get to dead flowers, which I thought was today. The kids next door are um, doing laps on the trampoline. <laughs> That'll tire them out for about three and a half minutes. Those kids are wild. They've been seeing lots of alligator gar, so I kind of waited around this morning at the edge, which the water has come way down. I don't think you can tell in the picture I took, but it's come way down. <clears throat> um, which they take it down this time of year anyhow. Actually, they take it down in the summer, but, well, I, it just depends on the weather. All right. Dee Dee Willingham does this so her lid doesn't stick, and it does work. You gotta make sure you get the lid on still. All right, I think I'm gonna have to go wash my hands. I'll be right back. I am back. Coffee. Mm. I got a few goodies yesterday. I think these are old. 2019, I guess not. Amy Tangerine, who I love, eight sheets of stickers. Which this is a great size, like a traveler's notebook size right here. So they can fit in. Oh, no, don't rip the tangerine label. All right, they're stapled in here, I think. They are. Hmm. All right, we'll do that another time. But, oh, I love the little dog in a sweater. They're like vinyl stickers. I like them. Oh, cute. Oh, papery. That's cute. These little towns. What was this line called? I never know the names of her lines. But I think it was like, it takes a village. Or I, don't quote me on that. I don't know. She had a lot of little village buildings in here. Kelly Perky did some villages one month on her stamp club. Her Traveler's Notebook Club, which is what I'm in. Life is about... Oh, here's some fall leaves. Life is about creating yourself. I like that. Just good stickers. Cute little cat. And some letters, which I think she said she did these. Anyhow. That's that. Perfect size for Traveler's Notebooks. I appreciate that. Then I got another thing of paper, and this is 2018. This was Stay Sweet, but I have the washi tape line for this, and I use it a lot. But this is the paper that coordinated with her washi tape. And I mean, I don't have to have it. It's just, you know... Another reason to buy something. Oh, I love that one. That has Amy Tangerine's name on it. Oh, I love these little hedgehogs. I love these. Anyhow. I like this bright. I just like her aesthetic. Kelly Perky's is good. But to me, Amy's is a little bit more hand done. Like, I can do that possibly and make my own paper. I love that they have these different um, borders. I hate the fact that there's a hole in it. And her bicycle paper, which of course I love. And I don't think any of these are repeated. I think this is all different. Some of it looks like it could have been printed on a computer, but a lot of it looks like she painted it or I could paint it. The cameras look printed, but I love that. So, that'll make an appearance somewhere. Blue and white. Yikes. I don't know what I'm going to do. I might just take the image from the magazine and see if I can use that. I was watercoloring in my Hobodichi to try to pre-do some pages. <gasps> Tomorrow is Friday the 13th. With a full moon. That's going to be so much fun. <laughs> I'm not superstitious. and But it's kind of cool. 
All right, blue and white. Here's blue and white. Oh, okay. See, my mom had plates like this on her walls in her kitchen and in her bedroom, their bedroom. But I might just cut these out somehow. So that's going to be rather tedious. Here's some more. This is in that same cabin that's in Old Town and South Dallas County, Alabama. Alabama. All right, we're going to cut. Tomorrow is leopard. Oh, I know why I did that. Okay. Sneak peek. That's as much as you get. And I still haven't fixed my cover. I've been gone every day this week. My goodness, who am I? My sloth spirit animal is being tested this week. All right, I think I'm just gonna do half a page today. I still love this. <laughs> That's the one that y'all are watching today, tomorrow for me, yesterday for me. All right, we're gonna put it right here. Blue and white. And I might fast forward. I, I did download some different Halloween music. I was getting tired of Monster Mash. Ooh, 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 ooh. I just had a brainstorm. There's blue and white gingham paper. We can do that. Not very Halloween-y, is it? Maybe we won't, maybe we'll do a little bit of the plates because that's what thought me through this and then do some pumpkins or something. We'll figure it out somehow, some way. So, yep, I'm gonna fast forward because I don't know how long this is gonna take. And that's for my Hobonichi. Stay focused, stay focused. Yikes. I have a piece of paper right here. I think it messes with the, I'm trying to get this crazy lighting a little better with what I have before I go out and buy something else because I'd rather spend my money on paper, you know? Okay. Oh, you know what? I don't have the overhead light on. Let's try that too. I hope that helps a little bit. And I'm going to include a picture of my quilt in this video because both of them that I'm working on. One's ready to go to the quilter. I only like doing the patchwork part. I don't like doing the quilting part. Um, they're pretty and colorful. Fast forward, that's it, enough rambling. Blue and white, here we come. This kind of looks purple, but it's, we're gonna, for the sake of today, we're gonna call it blue and white. Some lights it's purpley looking and other lights it's blue and white. Okay.
see this. Dark Shadow, the original complete series, and a coffin-shaped box with, like, cushion at the, on the underside. Oh, my goodness. How much is this? I'm not a Dark Shadows person. I don't think I've ever watched it. 1,245 episodes. Oh, my gosh. 131 DVDs. It's free. Available April 10th in 2012. This one has more black and white. Which I thought I could color one in, but then I found this. Kind of turquoisey now that I look at it. I don't know. We're going back to the blue Dracula. There goes the dog barking at the cat next door. Blue and white. This took a different... Hold on. I gotta go get the dog. Buggy. little dogs always think they can eat bigger dogs <laughs> always I have to protect the big dogs in my neighborhood from the little dog that I own okay blue and white this was an advertisement in that magazine for a Dracula movie now this is not gentle gross goblins but it's blue and white we made it gentle okay Bram Stoker ties in with where we were in Ireland because he was Irish I or he was born there and died there 
I don't know, Bram Stoker has a connection to Ireland. Blue and white lettering. We took the blue and white filigree lamp and the plates and the ginger jar and stuff like that and covered up the advertisement for the movie, as one does, and put it on this blue and white background, which I just love. And this has nothing to do with blue and white, but when I cut it out, I thought it was more blue. It's actually more turquoise. So I put it on this side, and it ties in with Dracula. Capiche? Capiche. Um, this is paper from a pad that I got at Michael's, a uh, generic one. And it's got the turquoise and gold popping out of it. And then I put the little guy down here, and this was on the bottom of this page. And then I put the paper behind it that I have been painting on, the deli paper, and it kind of softens all this other stuff down, but the turquoise brings it back, in my opinion. My very, 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 very limited knowledge of art opinion. I like it. That's the best opinion of all of it. So this is just, I just love it. It's the simplest things, people, that make us the happiest, right? Just stuff out of magazines, stuff out of my stash, stuff in a book that has seen better days. But let's see how our Mod Podge leaves are doing. I think they're gonna be okay. It'll dry, it'll keep them from drying out, which was my thought. But I don't want them to stick to this. So as they dry, I'm gonna keep picking them up. And we've been running over a few of them. They're just the last couple days because my husband is like anal about blowing the driveway all the time. Oopsie. So there's just a couple days, but we ran over them with our cars. So that's going to make it to the dead flower day a couple days from now. I don't think I'm going to do any more till Halloween now. I got it out of my system. I can relax. I can... Breathe deep. I got some stuff out of my system and some thoughts in my head for the real journal that is going to be pretty. Not that this isn't pretty, but it's going to be like basically just another Halloween journal. I cut fabric here yesterday. Oh, yeah, I said I was going to attach my quilt in here. I will. So now I'm going to put all these scraps, these things, in my Hobonichi, because that's what one does. So, fun! What's tomorrow? Fun, fun, fun. <gasps> leopard pheasant. That could go so many. It turned. It was supposed to be leopard and then pheasant, the next one down. But when I typed it, I got them together. I guess that's how I left out map. And... I think there should be leopard pheasants in everybody's life, right? Right. So, leopard pheasant tomorrow. Fun. My fake Copics are not so bad. Firefly, whatever that brand is, never heard of it. And now I'm going to go do housework because my house has been neglected all week. All I've done is art. This has been a lucky me art week. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. What did I do Tuesday? Monday. I know I did something Tuesday art week. Wednesday was the Nitwits. Tonight is the Nitwits at the library. Sunday was the art class. Monday was art class. There was something on Tuesday art besides this. Who knows? I'm just rambling. Thanks for watching. See you all tomorrow.